Hi everyone and welcome. In this review note, we are going to get rid of those annoying console messages that pop up in the middle of our commands. I'm going to start off by getting into global config mode. And then we're going to exit out of this so that we can see what I mean by that. So if I exit back out, notice that our prompt comes up um, for switch one, and then we get this message that comes up after that, and it just kind of leaves us uh, with that message displayed. So if I press enter, that takes us back to the prompt again, uh, and that's kind of annoying. What's even more annoying is if we're in the middle of typing a command and a console message comes up right in the middle of the command. Now, it won't be being configured from the console, but you know, say a, a port or an interface goes up or down or something like that, then we'll get this console message. Now, we can always press Control R for refresh, and that'll take us back to the command that we're partially finished, but that's also kind of annoying. So we're going to configure this so we don't have to do that. Go back into global config again, and Configuring the console messages so that they do not interrupt is part of the line configuration on the console. So I'm going to go back into uh, line, con line console config mode. And what we want to do once we're here is use a command called logging. So I'll do logging and then if we look at the options, the only thing really here is synchronous. So just complete the command, enter, and that's it, we're done. Now let's see the effect of that. So if I end from here and go back to privilege mode, notice we came up to our prompt and then the message got displayed on the console. But once that was done, we're back down to the prompt again here. And the reason for that is by setting logging as synchronous, it kind of does an automatic refresh for us every time a console message pops up. So that's something that is really useful for us. Hopefully you found this video useful and we'll see you next time.